Clutter really impacts your mental health, and that's why I'm so passionate about this challenge. It's not just about having a tidy home, it's about feeling lighter and healthier, both physically and mentally. So, funny story. I'm filming the intro to my decluttering challenge series almost a year after I posted the videos. Why? Well, they were originally part of a course, so they made sense back then, but now they're just floating around YouTube looking random. Especially on a channel that's mostly about mind-body health. The thing is, clutter really does negatively impact your health, and hey, for the woo-woo folks who love burning sage to clear the energy in their space, here's a fun insight. I was chatting with someone who is famous for banishing evil spirits, and they said that physical cleaning of the space is 90% of the work. So if you want to shift the energy in your space, this challenge is the perfect place to start. And that's why I encourage people to do this challenge and why I posted these videos freely up into the universe. So that if you are someone who wants to do the challenge, but you don't have anyone to do it with, you can work along here one day at a time and feel like you have a buddy who is doing the work right along with you. So here's the challenge. It's 30 days long. On day one, you get rid of one item. Really get rid of it. Out the door, out of your life. On day two, you get rid of two items. Especially in the beginning of this challenge, you want to choose items that make a visual difference. That means that when you look around your space, you can tell that you got rid of something. This is so important in giving you a feeling of accomplishment, lightness, and encouragement to keep going. So on day three, you get rid of three items. On day four, you get rid of four items. And so on and so forth until on day 30, you get rid of 30 items. At the end of the month, you will have decluttered over 450 items from your home. It sounds like a lot, but you will be shocked when you realize how much stuff you really have. Anyway, I hope you take up the challenge, and if you're all alone out there, I hope that my videos help you to feel less alone. Some of them are a bit rough and boring, because I'm a little old and just starting to get the hang of this video sharing thing, but whatever, who cares? Just start, take action, do the thing. Let the challenge begin. If you take on the challenge, comment below with your progress. I'd love to cheer you on.